Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another juicy video on the channel today. We're back on Twitter. I feel like after doing a few Twitter videos, there is nothing that can shock me anymore. I have become completely desensitized to some of the filth here on Twitter, but with that said, let's just jump right into the first tweet. For all those asking, I did have an OnlyFans, but not anymore. I had to take it down after my biggest fan turned out to be my own dad. Where do we even start with this tweet? Like I said, I'm not even shocked anymore. First impressions, I will say, this looks like some Twitter bait. You know, a fake tweet that's gonna get some attention, some quick likes and follows on someone's Twitter account. But you know what, I will say, I somehow don't doubt that there are some dads out there in 2021 subscribing to their daughter's OnlyFans accounts. It just really doesn't seem that far-fetched to me. I wonder how this happened though, because she says her dad was her biggest fan. It's not like her dad somehow found out she had an OnlyFans and subscribed just to see what she was up to. This man was apparently simping for his own daughter. Fuck. He paid well. But it just wasn't right. He gave my OnlyFans more than what he gave me in person. I don't know if I should laugh or be sad for this girl. Overall, my question question is why share this? Uh. Why was this lady compelled to share this information with the world? What was the gain here? She obviously doesn't have an OnlyFans anymore. This wasn't some promotional campaign. Did she do this for attention? I mean, probably. She got a nice uh, 63 likes. So this person here was asking the right questions. He asked if the dad knew it was her. And she replied, he didn't. I didn't show my face. That makes more sense now. We're learning more pieces of the story if it is in indeed true, which it kind of sounds like it is. If this is true, that's got to be the biggest L of 2021 so far. The biggest double L actually, not only for the girl, but the dad as well. I wonder how that next Thanksgiving dinner is going to go. How did you get to know that he was your dad? First time caught him looking at OnlyFans and didn't think much of it until I recognized one of my pictures. That's got to be one of the weirdest feelings possible. I feel awkward just hearing someone watching my YouTube video near me. Imagine seeing your dad salivating while looking at your nudes. This is also an L from the dad. Overall, this is a lineage L. Just an overall fat L for the family. Possibly the biggest I think I've seen in 2021 so far. To keep her memory alive, I'm working on uploading the entire collection of my late daughter Ava Martini to my OnlyFans. There will be modeling pics of her solo, topless selfie pics with her and I, and topless selfies with her and my other daughter, who is now retired, Alex. Yeah, Yet again guys, yet again I am not surprised. I'm just not shocked anymore. It goes without saying that this is just fucking disgusting on so many levels. Number one, this mom, mother of the year by the way, is milking her daughter who just passed away for every single penny possible. This takes e-begging to a whole other level I didn't even know existed. This mom is a master prestige e-begger and OnlyFans thought. Honestly, I think OnlyFans should straight up ban her. Posting your deceased daughter's nudes. If that's not already a rule, it should be. Also, did I read that correctly? Topless selfie pics with her and I. I'm hoping that this is fake. I, I really hope this is fake. Considering there's a watermark on the picture, I'm getting a sick feeling that's telling me this is real. The internet was a mistake. It's pretty hard for me at the moment to disagree with that statement. If this is in fact real, which again, I'm not shocked at all if it is, you already know that there's some down bad individuals foaming at their mouths trying to get this OnlyFans content. Why would anyone even be interested in looking at a mom and her biological daughter nude together? That's some high key incest kind of shit to keep her memory alive. Dude, SpongeBob memes really do fit anywhere. That's a pretty accurate summation I would say of this mom's actions, the mother of the year. This mom doesn't even belong to the streets. The streets are too good for her. I can't believe I'm even saying that. She belongs to the slums. My water just broke, but I had to get one last belly pick. Subscribe to my OnlyFans now to see my milky tits before anyone else. Just five dollars. You know what, I think I'm just gonna leave this right here. I can't go on any longer. <laughs> Thanks for watching and surviving yet another journey through Twitter with me today. If you haven't already, be sure to follow me on Twitter at Xenoshot because I'm gonna try and start being more active there. Stay tuned for some more juicy videos coming soon to the channel. And until then, stay sexy. Peace.